Okay, hey guys, this is Martin from HowToMakeMobileGames.com. Today is November the 21st, 2014. It's a Friday. And we just finished uh, Sniper XXX version 2, which was uploaded to Android and Amazon uh, two days ago. And the iOS one is now in, in uh, the review process. So what I've been doing in the meantime is uh, building a promo video for version two of Sniper XXX. And the reason is because obviously Android has, uh, on Google Play, you can put in videos. On Amazon, you can put in videos. Uh, but a new thing in iOS 8 is that you can also put in videos. So when the player is uh, scrolling through a, a search list, they can click on the play button and see what the game is all about. Uh, I think that's powerful if you've got a good video for sure. I think there's also a section on iOS 8 which promotes games that are, just have videos. And I've read for quite a long time that uh, games that do have a video uh, preview tend to get better downloads. Uh, obviously, that depends if the video is good or not. Um, so, but it's a cool thing, and, and I'm gonna. This obviously gives extra promotion as well. Um, I've seen a video recently for Candy Crush Saga, uh, Candy Crush Soda Saga, which I talked about on one of my other videos, and uh, it looked cool. You know, it was it was a short video. It was kind of quick. Uh, but it showed all the features, and I can see that that would have driven more downloads for sure. So I'm just going to quickly talk about that doing a video here. So the software that I use is uh, Camtasia. Very, very basic software, guys. This is not like Adobe Premiere where you can do, like, animation and effects. And uh, I don't do video editing very much, so I'm not a professional, so I don't know all the packages at all. But this is a very simple one. All I do is... Um, record the screen uh, in Camtasia and I turn off the camera. So I just hit the record button here, select the la, 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 camera off and just record the screen and the, syst the system audio here. And then what I've done inside of Unity, because we have the project here, I've just clicked on play and just done a screen recording of, of uh, some gameplay and the menu and the mission select screen. Once it's recorded, I've just put that into, uh, it's gone into Camtasia and there's all the media sections here. So these are all the different videos that I just played through before. There's a few minutes there of gameplay, uh, some music tracks, some audio. This is the mission, sorry, the menu, the main menu screen that I just did a couple of minutes ago. And I've layered them all here together as well. So I think hopefully it's made an okay um, promo video. Uh, you can put text in there as well, which overlays everything, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's not very clear to see at the moment, especially through this camera. Uh, and you can't hear it right now. I'll just turn on the volume for you guys so that you can hear what's going on. I've got my headphones plugged in, so let me just turn this up. It's not going to come through very clear, I don't think. And in fact, it might have to be a little bit louder. Um, but... You see, I don't know if this is going to be loud enough or not. I wanted to make this 30 seconds and it's turned out to be like 1 minute 30. Um, just because I wanted to sort of tell a little bit of a story at the beginning here with that text. Uh, get the, the main thing is, I think, for Sniper XXX, the cool, unique feature is that slow motion bullet follow thing. So I've made a point of uh, making that more of a feature in the video. Um, it does show a couple of shots where the player is just doing regular FPS shooting uh, without that bullet follow camera thing. But yeah, it turned out to be roughly, uh, I think, 1 minute and 35 or 1 minute and 40, so it's longer than what I wanted. Uh, I did mention some features in this part here as well. Uh, I'm going to upload this pretty soon, but I just wanted to say, guys, that, you know, those... those uh, with the app stores now, if you do have a, have a video uh, that looks pretty cool, then that should drive more downloads, um, but it has to be cool. Try to make a video short. I was aiming for 30 seconds and it's just turned into way longer. Uh, I think because there's there's actually more cool content in this than, you know, sort of uh, say uh, earlier this year when we were just doing very small single player games. Uh, that's the uh, main menu screen there. And then, you know, on iPhone, Android and Kindle. So uh, obviously make sure the player knows uh, knows what they're watching there. 
So, uh, yeah, hopefully uh, this will be okay. Camtasia is free as well for 90 days or one month. Uh, this is actually the paid package, which was, I think I bought it for £80 to get the license. It's about $110, but it was well worth it. I mean, I've done tons of videos through this, and I've also built uh, promo videos like you've just seen here. Uh, the process for actually getting the videos uploaded onto iOS and getting them approved, I don't know. The... Hopefully it won't be a problem because it's kind of gory. Obviously you've got you know heads exploding or whatever. Uh, I'm assuming though they already approved version one of the game, so I don't see why they wouldn't approve version two uh, video. Maybe we have to put some notice on there, like you know explicit material or whatever. Uh, so we'll see how that goes anyway. Uh, but let me know, guys, if anyone's done videos of their games uh, and uploaded them to say Google Play or Amazon, have you seen an increase in downloads? Did it make an impact or not? Uh, I definitely think from me watching the preview videos on the app stores for other games, it's definitely got my interest uh, more than just looking at the screenshots. So if done well, I think it can anyway. Uh, but let me know if this video is useful, guys. Please like, please subscribe, hit those buttons down there. That always supports me. Thank you so much. Um, as well, I'm not answering comments on YouTube anymore just because of time. Uh, but I do post all of the videos on howtomakemobilegames.com under the Martin's blog and video section. And I answer all questions and comments there, at least as much as I possibly can. So, but thanks for all the support, guys, and I hope this was useful. Chat to you all soon. Bye-bye.